Yo, what's going on with your YouTube drummer Chris here? We're coming back at y'all with another vid, man. And this is a very highly requested video. Shout out to the people that did uh, want this video, uh, How to Lace. I haven't done one in a long time. Last one I did one was the Air Jordan one, and it's my highest view video. So I guess I'm going to go ahead and go and go with the Air Jordan 4 since this is the new wave. It's the new hype. Might as well go ahead and uh, show you guys how I lace up my Air Jordan 4 is like how I do it in my on feet and just how I rock it uh, usually. Now I like my Air Jordan 4's uh, laces a little loose like this, how it pops out. Gives it that like slip on vibe, that loose feel and it just looks really great on feet. Now, usually with Air Jordan 4's, they come out already pre-laced up, mad tight. It's not like an Air Jordan 1 where it's like, it's down to the first eyelids, all right? so. I'm gonna try to show you ways how to style and how to lace up your Air Jordan 4s. Now there's really only like two to three ways to really lace these up to make them look good, but I'm gonna show you every way just so you guys can put it in your perspective and how you wanna lace your Air Jordan 4s. As I was saying, Air Jordan 4s, it already comes out pretty freaking tightly laced up like this. Now, what you wanna do is obviously, you wanna take it apart, unlace it. Now just unlace the top part, the first, the first eyelids here. Because the way how they lace it, it's usually factory, it goes in. You want it to go out if you want it to make it look like this. So take that out, and it's gonna be out of the wing, uh, the little lace wing. Now from here, you can do it two or three ways. You can do it the lazy way, or you can do it like the actual fishing way. The lazy way, if you want to do something real quick, you just go like this, kind of just loosen them up like this. Um, this is where you're just getting out of the box, and maybe you want to just throw it on real quick, all right? So you just loosen up all the laces here. Start from the top, then to the bottoms here. This is what you do, all right? This is, the, like I said, this is just a real lazy way. You wanna do this real quick. You're trying to just wear it out. You just get them real loose up. And then from here, usually I start with the second eyelid right here on top. If you guys can see the second eyelid. Start off with the second eyelid right here. Right there, go through. And the same thing, the middle eyelid here, the middle one, go through that, voila, just like that, boom. Same goes with this side. You wanna go to the second eyelid here, just like that. See what I'm saying? Onto the second eyelid. And that's how, that is the lazy way, just like that. Still good to go, still looks decent on feet. Just try to like kinda, you know, maybe if you want, you can kinda like straighten up the laces a little bit because you don't want it to be, you know, since it's flat rope laces, you don't want it to be all twisty and stuff. So you kinda wanna make it look somewhat good. Now that is one way to do it, all right? Me personally, I like to go all out. I'm gonna go ahead and unlace the entire shoe. This is the best way to do it. So that way you can get exactly um, the look you want and also the, uh, you know, the way how it's kinda gonna be molded to your feet. We're at the starting point, just like an Air Jordan 1. Make sure it's nice and flat and wide the way you want it so it won't be, you know, so you can have some space to it. On the on the first eyelid, make sure it's nice and uh, decently wide for your foot. I like to do one or two things. You can either st uh, stick a sock in it if you're doing it like this, or you can actually put this on your feet and then do it. I'm just gonna go ahead for video purpose, put a sock in it, so that way it kind of acts like my foot's in there. Now, very easy, make sure also the laces is basically the same length all the way, pull it all the way up, so you need, if you need to adjust it. From here, it's very easy. All you have to do is just keep going over like this, like make an X, make sure the laces are, compl are always flat, throughout when you lace it and then you're gonna have to go uh, through the laces. And pull, you can just pull one, just make sure while you're pulling it through, make sure it's flat. That's just kind of one thing so that way it doesn't look all crazy and twisted and look kind of ugly. Make sure every time you put it, uh, the laces through, see it's not all twisted like that. Make sure you make it's all flat. And then before you put it to the next eyelid, always just kind of make sure it's kind of, you know, always kind of stretch it out a little bit. So that way you give it that loose look. And there you go, just like that. Again, cross over, then put the laces to the next holes and then all the way up. And again, every time while you're putting the laces through, your laces through, make sure the lace is always flat, just like that. Make sure it's always flat. That is basically the key is to make the laces flat because if you don't, it gets all twisty. 
it's gonna look really ugly. Just keep, and then also every time when you're done, always keep pulling it back like that. Again, keep pulling it. Make sure it's like when you get to the top, you want it to be kind of like, you know, uh, kind of like flared out a little bit, you know? So just continue doing it. Keep pulling it while you're lacing it. All right, from this point, you can kind of figure out how you want to do this. Um, if you want to leave your wing uh, laces, I see some people that leave it like wide flap and open. So from here, you can actually kind of, this is some people where they actually tie it. You know, I see some people tie it like this and they just rock it like this where it just have the wing flap. Like I said, we're trying to go for this look where you just kind of go through the first eyelid. All right, so now here, we don't have much laces left. Again, you want to go over, go to this, uh, there's six holes total and you want to go to the middle one, go to the middle top, all right? I know it gets kind of confusing, but go to the middle top again, just like that, to the second wing, to, to, to the lip waist, the wing laces right here. And that's kind of like, almost like a lock. And then right here. So you had two choices between, you can lace it up or like that, because this is the look that you want, where it's kind of free, open like that. You had the laces kind of just popping out slip on vibe you know comfortable vibe and like i said you kind of want to make the laces so that way it doesn't cover the tongue you see the jump man the flight you want to see that you don't want to, uh the laces to cover so that's how i lace up my air jordan 4 guys you guys let me know what you guys think about this look I, like i said on feet i think it looks incredible it looks great that's how i've always uh, lace up my air jordan 4s talking and doing reviews on air jordan 4s for a long time and this is how the look it's I, I, I feel like this is like kind of the most look that a lot of people like on air jordan 4s but again if you want to tighten if you want to you know tighten up or uh, tie your shoe obviously you just want to you know tie uh you know tighten these up a little bit uh like i said i, I just want to get that loose look to it but you know obviously tighten these up a little bit so you can give more laces so that we can tie it or just tie it while it's in the middle so here it is just a couple other variations how you can lace it up i like it like this here you guys have it man this is the way how i lace up my air jordan 4s like i said i'm going for comfy vibes slip on uh if you, like i said if you guys want to tie it there's other ways to do things you know if you just want to tighten up the laces but i'm going for the loose look you know the comfortable vibe anytime like you just wear it slip it on you're good to go put it back in the box until the next time you rock them man so this is how i've always laced up my air jordan fours sometimes i do the lazy way or if i really want to get it and make it look really nice take all the laces off man it's a little bit more work but it's definitely worth it let me know how you guys style your air jordan fours you know um like i said i think air jordan fours look great with jeans especially skinny jeans where i don't like my air jordan fours the tongue is not crazy big like an air jordan five so i love to still show the tongue the tongue i feel like with air jordan four it's just a staple it just shows it off you know like i said it just always looks great with it on feet i just try not to sh uh, cover the heels or or the tongue because i feel like this is more of a that staple for air jordan 4 but if you want to cover it that's fine too i know that's a new look too a lot of people like to you know have the the jeans over uh shoes a lot lately i mean that's probably one of the best reasons why to have like a union because the tongue is tucked in but air jordan 4 with that tongue it looks so good but anyway guys i appreciate y'all i hope this video helped you guys out man you guys let me know how you guys lace up your air jordan force or if this video did help you guys out man make sure you guys please hit that thumbs up subscribe if it's your first time here comment down below and please hit that bell for all the notifications when i do drop vids and don't forget to follow me on my social media at german chris on ig sometime on twitter and don't forget snapchat anyway guys appreciate y'all love y'all i'm german chris push